It's enough to make your blood run cold. It's 10 o'clock. Do you know where your children are? Ugh, next. And at 1 o'clock on Can You Believe It? We talk to a man with proof that the legendary feathered people of China really exist and see the first clear videotape of Sasquatch. How rude! Oh, mighty general, why is it that these wretched humans can find the other dark stalkers, but you fail time and again? Fail? I've bested you time after time, rat girl. Finding dark stalkers is no problem. Observe. Ship, show me the location of all those with dark stalker blood. See? Finding them is not the problem. Recruiting them for our cause, that's the problem. There aren't many of us left, are there? Ship, why are there so few? Are you sure you're showing all of them? The reason for the scarcity is unknown. Insufficient data. And don't call me Ship. It makes me wonder if someone has been eliminating us. Not possible. We are too strong for humans to destroy. <laughs> Who or what are you? You have been found guilty of crimes against humankind. Do you have any justification for your actions? Yeah, I'm faster, stronger, and smarter than humans. I take what is my right. Who are you to judge me? I am not your judge. The Lady of Mercy has seen to that. I am here to carry out the sentence. Darkstalkers will return. And now, back to Darkstalkers. Felicia, you've got to see this. All right, Harry, all right. I was checking out a news group on the net, and you won't believe what I found. Something really weird happened last night in Cape Town, South Africa. Look! The body of Hendrik Farr, CEO of Land and Ocean Investments, was found on Clifton Beach. The police have refused to comment, but witnesses said it looked as if he was attacked by a wild animal of unusual size. What's that got to do with us? I checked! There aren't any large predators left down on the Cape. I bet it's a dark stalker. Harry, for all we know, it could be an escaped zoo animal. Or it could be another werewolf! One we don't know about! We've got to check it out! Uh-uh, not a chance. Even though you're in the advanced classes, you still have to show up at school occasionally. Oh, come on, Felicia! We're a team! And I have that off-off Broadway musical. <sighs> All right, we should find out. If it is a new Darkstalker, we need to know as soon as possible. I'll ask Riku to take a look. We both saw that light go out last night. Something down there is destroying us, and I'm going to find out what it is! It's probably just a mistake on the ship's part. I keep telling you, we can't be destroyed! If that's true, how come there are so few of you? And I do not make mistakes. Ah, see? We've got to find out what's happening! Lord Raptor is in South Africa. I will have him investigate, but I'm certain he will find nothing. Raptor? That moldy Mick Jagger? Why bother with the likes of him? Raptor or no one? My mind is made up. Oh, what mind? Now look, don't you sweetie baby me of you pop rock parasite. This tour stinks on ice, man. They only sold 12 tickets last night. They paid me in deposit bottles. Raptor! I have a job for you. Oh, wonderful. It all has to be better than this. What is it? Poker music? I want you to go to Cape Town, check out any reports of sorcerers or anyone capable of harming us. Yeah, sure. Live and let die is what I say. Eh, it's all rock and roll to me. Man, I bet I'm chasing a wild goose. Ooh, then again. <laughs> Who are you then, love? I am Sinko, a hunter of evil. 
<laughs> well, you found it then. I did not expect another battle so soon. My prey rarely comes to me. I got you, babe. Don't do me like that. Who sent you to find me? Uh, the pinball wizard. Fire and run. Who sent you? <laughs> I heard it through the grapevine. A name. Give me a name. Now where to run to, baby? Let us try again. I need the name of the one who sent you here. The name! Get over it! Well, another one bites the dust! In a New York minute! The lady desires your presence. Oh, do you really want to hurt me? Stop right there! So, you have called for reinforcements. They will not help you. I have hunted the evil ones for more than a century. I am more than a match for both of you. But, there is a misunderstanding. I am not evil. I refused to join them when they ordered me to. I do not believe you, though you are strangely attractive for a fishman. My turn. Oh, blimey! Who died? And I thought I was ranking. I am a spirit, a ghost. I have no need to breathe. Your magic will not work on me. Walk away, Renee! You really got me? Goodbye, Yellow Brick Road! Dimitri! Must be punished. Dark Stalkers will return. And now, back to Dark Stalkers. I have been called many things, but never that. Yet, you would attack me with your spinning tin toys when I am unarmed. Is that better? <sighs> Much. Where is she? I am not evil! I have been told that before. Evil often lies. What can I say to convince you of my innocence? Nothing. All dark stalkers must be destroyed. No! I have not hurt you, and I won't. It was the only way I could stop you long enough to listen to me. So talk. There are those of us with dark stalker blood who reject Dimitri, who are not evil. Then why are you here? I am investigating the possibility that there may be a new Darkstalker. Then you two are hunting Henrik Farr. No. You hunted the Executive. Why? He was a werewolf. A Darkstalker. He had been preying on people for decades. The Lady wants humans protected from his kind. He had to be stopped. So you really are a hunter. Who is this lady? <sighs> Perhaps you could let me out first. I hope you realize that I am not an enemy, and that you will cease your attack. I believe you. I apologize for attacking you. Hearing that name after so long... But... what... what name? I, I don't understand anything of what you're talking about. It began when Mei Ling and I were twelve.
father welcomed the visiting lord Dmitri Maximov to our land and invited him into our home as father superior had asked him to do. Soon after his first visit, our mother disappeared. Father said she'd gone to visit her own family, but she would have told us, not just disappeared. He came back six years later, seeking unique sculptures, or so he claimed. And again, our father welcomed him into our home. That night, something woke me up. I went to check on our father and found Lord Dimitri was there. He told me a messenger had come and our father had left immediately. Then he looked at me and I could not move. Mei Ling came out to see what was going on, why I wasn't in bed. Somehow, when Mei Ling bumped me, I woke up and was suddenly able to move again. That's when Lord Dimitri attacked us. We managed to get past him somehow, and ran outside. He chased us. We ran as fast as we could, but Mei Ling, we caught her. She yelled at me to run, to get away. That was the last time I saw my sister, or any member of my family. What happened after that? I was afraid to return to town, for fear Lord Dimitri would find me. I wandered the roads, begging for food, but no one would help me. In the ruins of an ancient temple, I found what I thought was a jar of rice. I was so hungry, I ate it without tasting it first. It was an ancient powder made of ground topaz. As the old stories told, such things transform people. It made me what I am today, a ghost. The Lady of Mercy, Quan Ying, came to me then. She told me that I was no longer human. I was an immortal. I pleaded with her to let me be human again so I could find my sister. But the Lady said it was impossible. Does not sound very merciful to me. Her mercy is not always the same as ours. She offered me the chance to become her hunter. There were those like Dimitri, who were not human, who preyed on her children. The Darkstalkers? Yes. So since then, I have been doing her will, making this world safer for humankind. And someday, I will find Lord Dmitri Maximov. You! You! You sent me there! I thought you might have some ability. It's a mistake I won't make again. Would you care to bet on that, boy, or...? She... She broke my Stratocaster, man. All right, all right. Don't come all unglued. I'll fix it myself. You will never speak to your general like that again, you undead pest! That does it. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. I told you not to send Raptor after her. If you're so certain of everything, you deal with it. Oh, well, you're putting me in charge then. I am giving you an order! If you think you're up to it. I'm more than a match for any human, no matter what magic they use. I prefer a battle on ground of my own choosing, Hunter. One of the evil ones, I presume. Yes, probably Morrigan. She's a sorceress as well as a Darkstalker. It is enough to know that she is evil. Good luck, Sinko! Greetings, Morrigan. I am Sinko, my lady's hunter. I hunt only for myself. You lie, dark creature! I know that you serve another! I must warn ye! I don't fight fair! Your kind never does! Fair or foul, you are no match for me!
you have any reason why I should not end your miserable existence right now? Reasons? I got reasons. What sort of reasons would you like? Do you know of the one who calls himself Lord Dimitri? <laughs> I know of him far too well. So, you're interested in old Overbite? I have an affair of honor to settle with Lord Dimitri Maximov. Honor? With Dimitri? That's a first. If I could uh, bring him to you... Bring him within my arm's reach. You have my word that I will let you live. Ah, this is going to be fun. No, we need to make this look good to bring down old Dimitri. Oh, they are fighting a mighty battle. I thought you said you could handle the hunter yourself, Morrigan. Well, we were mistaken. The hunter isn't what we thought. She's like us. She's heard of you and wants to join. If she's one of us, why have I not heard of her before? Well, perhaps you're not as smart as you- Silence, woman! Where is she? will be your turn soon, my dear. This is the great sorceress? She's a mere human. You, I remember you. Your sister was delectable. Zinko, don't let him touch you! Morrigan, deal with that fish thing. No. Never again! You are making this easy. You will no longer be allowed to do to others what you did to my family! Mention them. You have no right. You deprived me of my parents, my sister, my childhood, and my life. Over 100 years of guilt for escaping you when they could not. I vow that you shall never harm anyone else ever again. <laughs> She's Lord Dimitri! Is that the best you can do? And to think I was terrified of you all these decades! You should always be terrified of Lord Dimitri, Master of the Dark Stalkers! So, General. Cinco, now is your chance. Destroy her too. No, I gave my word. She gave me Lord Dimitri. She goes free. What? Well, I never promised her anything. Say goodnight, Morrigan. Ship, now! 
saved by hunting and destroying evil. You may not have saved your own family, but you've saved many others, I'm sure. He is right, my daughter. But it's all useless. Useless? <laughs> you have learned tears again. Compassion for yourself, not just the rest of the world. That's a victory in itself. And as Riku said, there will be other opportunities. Thank you. You are indeed the Lady of Mercy. And my thanks too, Lady. Sinko does not stand alone in fighting evil. Though not human, you are indeed one of my children. If you need me, call. No matter where I am, I will hear. Wait until Felicia hears about this. <laughs> Wait till you hear what happened. It wasn't a dark stalker at all. It was something lots better. And I'm sure you're gonna tell me what it was, right? It was a ghost who hunts dark stalkers. Well, she used to. Now, Riku said she knows some of you are good, so she only hunts the evil ones. That's great. We really don't need a second Donovan to watch out for. Oh, I wish I'd gotten a chance to meet her, though. She's Chinese and might have been able to teach me Chinese magic. Oh, I'm sure there'll be other chances to meet her. But for now, why aren't you at home? Don't you have school tomorrow? Oh, Felicia! Darkstalkers will return 